Hey there guys, what's up? It's your boy George, back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the new Battle Pass that's just dropped in WWE Supercard and also the other stuff surrounding it. So that being said, let's get right into the video. Right then guys, we're learning into WWE Supercard now and let's see what is in store for us today. Terry Funk, Cactus Jack and more ECW Legends featuring the new hardcore icon sets available today and Brian Pillman leads the Battle Pass. So let's take a look at the Battle Pass first. And then we'll have a look at the stuff surrounding it in packs and whatnot. Right then, guys. Battle pass. Let's take a look at it. Let's see. Let's go through it as I always do. Okay, so the Brian Pillman card is very, very cool. That is a very, very cool and different type of card design. We haven't had one like this before in the game, I don't think. So obviously, level one gives you 25 picks as always. And then obviously, if you pay for it, then the Brian Pillman uh, battle pass card. Level two gives you a portrait image of Brian Pillman. Level 3 gives you a PvP bout reducer. Level 4, 300 super coins and a fusion chamber bout reducer. Well, fusion chamber perk, sorry. Level 5, performance center perk. Level 6, 300 super coins. Level 7 is a bronze pack. And a ECW card pack as well as 250 uh, super coins. Then level 8 is a performance center perk again. Level 9 is another 400 super coins. Level 10 is... 250 credits on the free side, another 250 on the paid track. Then level 11 is a team event perk. Level 12 is another 500 super coins. Level 13 is another 500 super coin on the free track. And a Sandman uh, attitude with 200 extra super coins on the paid track. Level 14, an RDP pick. Level 15, 650 super coins. Level 16. Gives you a silver pack as well as a money in the bank bout time reducer perk. Then level 17 gives you a gold pack. Level 18 is another 800 super coins. Level 19 is the RDP pick on the free track and on the pay track another two. So that's three in total there. Level 20 is a Brian Pillman attitude with uh, another 200 super coins. Level 21, 900 super coins. Level 22, a grand challenge reward pack and a platinum pack. On the pay track, level 23, two RDPs. Level 24, another 1,000 super coins. Level 25, you get a gold pack on the free track. And on the pay track, you get the pro Brian Pillman. So that looks super, super dope. I was going to have a look if there's a quest alongside this. Obviously, there's a battle pass quest as always. But there's no actual quest. Let's have a quick look at the store. See what else is there. So you got ECW packs. you got builder pack at the top as well. Okay, these cards look very, very cool. Yeah, the card design is awesome. The card design is really, really dope. Holy Lord. So you've got Cactus Jack, you've got Terry Funk, Sensational Sherry, The Sandman. I mean, what's the percentage on that? 12% 12, 12 odds. Ugh, not for me, Chief. Then you've got 3,000 credit packs. I mean, it guarantees you uh, a Sandman. <laughs> it pretty much guarantees you a Sandman or Sensational Sherry, which are the lowest tier cards at WrestleMania 40. The others are obviously both Enigma. I'd assume, yeah, so... 3% odds on those, but for 3k credits, those odds should be way higher. Then you've got Anarchy Rules Packs with 5% odds, and uh, yeah, pretty much get Sandman, and that's about it. Uh, so yeah, let me see if there's collectibles out for this. Okay, so there are collectibles, okay, which is really, really dope. Can you convert into Super Coins? You can. Okay, so there'll be a video on the channel uh, either tomorrow or some point this week on how to get unlimited Super Coins using this method. So yeah, so 250 super coins gets you a, an Enigma tier ECW card. 150 super coins gives you an Enigma tier card. Not super coins, sorry, collectibles. Then 125 collectibles gets you another Enigma tier card. Uh, 50 collectibles gives you a chance pack. At the ECW cards, 25 gives you another. That's, no, 30 gives you another chance pack. They're, these are different ones. These are Ultra Clash ones. Let me see if they're in the store so I can tell you which ones they are. So the Ultra Clash, are they here? The Ultra Clash is 750, and the other ones are, are, are these ones, the 350 ones. So, obviously, you see those odds based on what the packs are in the store. Then, obviously, five give you 25 draw picks, and um, one of them gives you 20 super coins. So, again, I'll be converting my, uh, my collectibles that I will be getting off of these into super coins for you guys. So, obviously, you guys can see how to literally farm unlimited super coins using the method. I mean, I'm doing it now with the... Uh, with the what do we call it the um macho king tokens so yeah 
I mean, it'll be the exact same method, but it'll be covered in a separate video for you guys on the channel some point this week. So make sure you guys stay subscribed for that. So hopefully you guys don't miss out on that. But with that being said, that's going to do it for the video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of the ECW cards. Let me know if you're going to be buying the Battle Pass. Just let me know what you guys think of the whole event. I think it's really, really cool. Some are different in the game. Some are throwback. Some people have been really asking for some throwback era cards like ECW and stuff like that, which is really, really dope. I'm, I'm always down for that. But yeah, man, with that being said, it has been the boy George. If you guys have liked this video, please do all that, but subscribe already. We're on the road to 3,100 subscribers. We're trying to hit before the end of the month. With that being said, it has been the boy George, and I'll see you guys on the next one very, very soon. Bye!